Alright, live from uh, Central Steel. So we want to talk today first a little bit about some outfield drills. So we're going to do the fundamental drills that we do every day at practice, every day before a game. Uh, most of you older girls have probably done these before and then for you younger girls this is something you want to start doing every single day. So we're going to start first without a ball, without a glove, just basic fundamental drills that you want to work on with your footwork. And the most important thing here is going to be how you want to approach a ground ball from the outfield. You know, obviously everybody's talking about getting to the ball quick. You want to sprint to the ball. You want to get there fast so that you can get it in quickly. But the approach to the ground ball is probably the most important part. So if you fast forward past, you know, reading the ball off the bat, getting into a good position, I want to talk to you about how you approach fielding the ground ball. So the key point here is let's, let's say that for this demonstration, my glove is the ball. So if I'm sprinting to the, to the ground ball, you don't have to roll it yet, coach. I'm going to put the ball. So as I get about this distance from the ball, so right now I'm looking at about 10 yards from the ball, I've, I've gotten around it, I've done whatever I need to do, and I'm in my sprint to the ball. Then I make my approach. Once I get about this far, you want to start chopping your feet down, taking smaller steps. This is going to allow you to time up your hand and your feet so that you field the ball in the right way. So what you don't want to have is some kind of awkward where you're fielding the ball back here off the wrong foot. You always want to field the ball off of your glove side foot, outside of your glove side foot. So if that's my ball, I'm full speed till about 10 yards out. I break my feet down small so that when I approach the ball, as you can see, I'm right here outside of my glove side foot. Nice and small feet. And when I'm coaching this in practice, I'm saying small feet to the ball, small feet to the ball on the approach. I'm boom, 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 small feet, boom, right there when I field. And then I want to come up and I want to get my steps right for my throw. So you can work a crow hop, you can work a kick behind, whatever's more comfortable for your style. So here, boom, 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 field. I get a little step and boom, I throw. So you can work a crow hop, which is the big step in the front. So here, boom, 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 step. Big step in front. Or you can work the kick behind. Either one is fine, just as long as you're gaining ground to your target. So here, boom, 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 kick behind, throw. Either one is fine. So these are drills you can do with no ball, just working your footwork, or you can get with a partner. I got Coach McKenna here. She can be the expert roller. Your roller doesn't have to throw this hard. You just nice and smooth, roll through it. All you want to do is work your footwork. So if your partner will just nice and easy, boom, 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 right there, nice and easy, flipping back. You can do this with your partner all day. This is the best way to get ground ball practice. Go ahead, boom, nice and easy, boom, right there, kick behind, however you want to do it. Now, if you're like me, you're already out of breath, <laughs> start working some other drills. So let's say if you want to get more challenging, Kick this cone out of the way. No limitations here at Central Softball. So you can work side to side. So the difference is, if I boom, ball off the bat, anything not right at you, you want to try to get an angle on the ball. So that when you field the ball, you're coming in towards your target. Either to your right or to your left, whatever. Boom, here I'm ready. Drop step, angle around the ball. Boom, there's your partner. So these are ground ball footwork drills you can do all day, every day. In the next video, we'll do fly balls.